Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, let me introduce to one of the most prominent sub-project of the Spring Boot framework. See here, here I am having the Spring Boot Angular project. In this project, I have added the actuator dependency, which is a actuator dependency. The main theme of this Spring Boot actuator is to help us to monitor and manage the Spring Boot app. It contains all the endpoints. That means where we can access each resource. If you want to get production ready features in an application, we should use the Spring Boot Actuator. Spring Boot Actuator provides a lot of useful health endpoints and metrics right out of the box with zero coding. Spring Boot 2 has made some significant changes to Actuator, keeping the intent but simplifying and improving its capabilities. It now comes with the micrometer support. When we click here, controller micrometer, see here. From Spring Boot 2, it has come with the micrometer support. The micrometer dependency is automatically added as a part in the actuator dependency. In the actuator dependency, the metrics can also be exposed to a number of systems like at least Neuralic, Prometheus, JMX, etc. These are the Spring Boot 2 actuator changes that has made in the spring boot to changes actuator changes the metrics can also be exposed to a number of systems like at least neuralic prometheus jms etc the actuator endpoints can be accessed by slash actuator after the base url see here close Close. The application has already started running. It is working. Let me open this post now. Here, localhost colon eighty eighty slash actuator. See here, the actuator endpoint can be accessed by slash actuator after the base URL, base URL is slash. See here, when, when I scroll it down, we have the info endpoint, help path, health, links. If, if, I, if I click here, and click on send it will show the health status as up when I go there in the console see by default this actuator exposing the two endpoints beneath the base path we no need to configure the these two health and info endpoints extra by default they are available at the beneath the base path slash actuator <coughs> sorry the slash matrix endpoint previously returned some metrics but now instead of displaying metrics it displays metric names in spring 2.0 which you can append to matrix endpoint to see for details. For example, if I click here, slash matrix and click on send.
enable it. Control C. Okay. Slash actuator slash metric. See here. In the application, what I have did is I have included the I have enabled the uh, endpoints complete endpoints by using this asterisk symbol management dot endpoints dot web dot exposure dot include equal to asterisk that means it will enable and display all the endpoints here I'm having the metrics from 2.0 onwards the slash metric endpoints previously returned some metrics but now previously means before one uh, in 1.5 up to 1.5 it previously returned some metrics but now instead of displaying metrics it displays metric names which you can append to metric endpoint to see for the details for example here what i am doing is i am copying this matrix slash click on send it will get the hikari cp dot connections dot usage the usage connections usage it will display all the complete details like that all the endpoints except shutdown are enabled by default by default shutdown bin has been uh, enabled <coughs> uh, by default shutdown 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 bin has been has been off that means it has been disabled by default we have to enable it if we want to use that shutdown for example if a management dot endpoint dot shutdown dot enable we should set it to true if you want to use this shutdown by default this shutdown will be disabled we have to enable it by assigning it to true when we save this see here Let me open the postman once. Post actuator slash shutdown. Click on send. See here the message is shutdown by. That means it is terminating the project. See here, Hikari Pool 3 shutdown initiated, shutdown completed, like that. Security, only the health and info endpoints are exposed by default. We have seen it before now. Health and info endpoints are enabled by default. Run as Spring Boot app. Security model for actuator is streamlined and is now integrated with main apps security that means security model for actuator for actuator security model is streamlined uh, it is now integrated with the main app security in the next session we will discuss about uh, in detail about health endpoint how we can access in detail access of the uh, detail access of the health endpoint by using spring security uh, the actuators are not technology agnostic because previously they rely on MVC but now not they are technology agnostic. A new react to health indicator interface has been added to implement the react to health checks in 2.0. Spring Boot Actuator 2.x version has redesigned the way to achieve this by using a date of endpoint annotation. It significantly simplifies the process of creating user defined endpoints here if you want to see here if I enable this okay. we can if you want we can change the base part also 
like the java e planet i'm setting the base path as a java e planet i'm disabling this shutdown control cell now we can use the uh, after slash after base path we can use the slash java e planet instead of actuator we can use java e planet as a base part see here slash actuator slash java e planet slash java see here that's all in 2.0 they had changed in such a way that we can use or we can change the base path in in the way in which way we we want we want we, uh, we can configure our base path on our requirement on our requirement basis uh, slash java planet for example if i want to access the beans slash beans like that it will expose all the beans all the beans It will expose all the bins like that. Oh. Config config props. See here, these are the configuration properties. See here. This is the configuration properties like that we can access everything in the actuator beans metrics health info by default those are available health and info info status beans like that we can access everything in this session we have discussed about what are the changes that has been made in actuator spring boot 2.0 from 2.0 onwards in the next video we will discuss in detail about the spring boot actuator actuator thank you